probably more disappointed than pleased. Um, pleased with the performance, certainly first half, where I, where I thought we were really good. Um, probably the disappointment is, is that you know we sort of finish a game and you're trying to make sure that you don't lose this game. You know they'd made a lot of changes, went a little bit more direct in that that last period of the game. But I thought, as regards control of the game, I thought we, we it was one of our good performances. Uh, we just needed to get that goal to to perhaps make that difference, and you know perhaps give ourselves uh, you know, that little bit more in that final third. First half was maybe as as good as you passed it all season. Do you think? Uh, yes. Yeah. And and um, I mean I think credit to. At Bristol City, I think they've gone through a difficult period. They've had a lot of injuries, and so you know that's one that's difficult to sort of deal with. Um, and we hope to capitalise on it, and I think we did in that first half period. It probably did show, you know, the you know, one team that perhaps is, is in better form than the others. But you always you always expect a reaction, and uh, they got the reaction that their their manager and club would have wanted in that in that second half, and made it far more difficult for us. Um, but in them good periods, in that first half period, you know that's when we really needed to capitalise on it with goals. I know football's not about ifs and buts, but maybe the kind of game that if you had scored in that first half, then it might have been more comfortable for you. You might have gone on and get, you know, two or three like you did last Monday. Yeah, well, I think what Monday said was the timing of the goal. You know, to score just before half time, and then we was able to come out in the second half and score and score two goals. Uh, yeah, I do think that, um, but the responsibility is up to us, you know, to, to make sure that we, we achieve that. And, uh, you know, what Bristol City would be saying is, is that, you know, they've defended well enough in that first half period, perhaps didn't play so well, but defended well enough. In that, and it's the responsibility for us is to, to make that happen. And wasn't able to do that in a good performance. Overall, overall, I think in the perhaps the scheme of things, it's, it's away from home, it's a clean sheet, it's a draw, so I think we can't be over disappointed with that. Yeah, I was going to say, I mean, it, you can be still happy with a performance, can't you, as, as a manager and as a coaching staff, even if you didn't get all three points? Yeah, I mean, what, one thing that I, I certainly wanted, even if we looked at this last six games as a group of games, it, for, what's important for me is that we finish the season well. That doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be the exact results that, that you want, but we, we finished the, the, the season in you know as regards to performances that we finish it well and so probably I think that was that was a touch of it today where I think we our level of performance was good um, but unfortunately we didn't get the result we wanted. And as you mentioned you touched on it earlier important at the other end to to stay switched on in, in the last few minutes because you would certainly not have wanted to go away from this one losing it 1-0 would no, you? No well it was a few scary moments you know towards the end and you know they they made a lot of changes, went a little bit more direct into, into the front, caused us a few more problems, and and I think we would have been kicking ourselves if you know if they end up scoring in them last moments. So, so you know that's all part of it, and I think probably overall you know we'll look at this as a as a decent result, even though perhaps disappointed with it.